There's nothing more insulting than getting shut out on your own home turf, and it doesn't happen here very often. The last one, Stanford, nine years ago, and the last non-conference opponent hasn't done it since 1979. Man, that was a complete, uh, I would say, beatdown in every phase. It's our job to get the offense going, run game, pass game. You know, we didn't protect as well as we should have. We didn't get enough movement in the run game, so it all starts with us. But it reflects back onto the quarterback. Freshman Brendan Lewis finished his start with 55 yards passing. And get this, negative 27 yards on the ground. He's having a hard time. I got to watch it and see it and talk to him and, and see what he's seeing and tell me what he's seeing and all that stuff, but he's, he's struggling out there. True freshman Drew Carter relieved him in the fourth quarter and showed flashes of promise. But will we ever see another competition? You know, we're just, you know, we're young at that spot. It's unfortunately for us. But we will, we were going to, we're still going to turn over every stone and we're going to figure out what to do. And it might mean, does he, does he get a chance to get some series and games now just because of, you know, he might be able to create, create a spark? You know, we may have to do that. Head coach Carl Durrell says he's turning those stones over all over the offense, and that includes his own coaches and play callers. Nothing is off limits to get this team back on its feet to start Pac-12 play next week. In Boulder, Ariel Orsuto, 9 News.